Hi guys, welcome to another video on the JV hey. and Millie channel and we are bringing you a really special tier list today because we are going to be taking a close look at the new Sanrio villages with you guys. So we have recently had six new villages added to the game. We have Marty, we have Rilla, Toby, Chelsea, Chai and Atoyle. So we are going to be putting those in a tier list today, focusing just on the islanders themselves, none of the items that they bring with them or anything like that, just the concepts, the aesthetic and what we think of them. Which is absolutely amazing, but if you do want to see a ranking of all the kind of furniture items, please make sure to subscribe and comment down below. And also make sure to comment who your favourite of this set is. Just because they may not be our preference doesn't mean that they're not absolutely cool, because I think it's fair to say that these are all amazing islanders. They are indeed. So... We have the four tiers today. S is we love them. We're inviting them to the island straight away. A is the cute. There might be a time that we need them. Might not be now. B is they're okay. We don't think we're really going to invite them though. And C is, you know, it wouldn't impact us if they were never added to the game. We don't really like them. Yeah. So working our way along the little photos you can see there, we are going to invite these amiibos to the island. So you get to take a closer look at them in case you've not had the opportunity to do so already. So let's open the camera and let you guys have a closer look at Marty. So they are a cute little cub. They have this gorgeous little hat on. They have this t-shirt that you're able to get in the game as well. And I really like the cub islanders. I do think Marty is really quite sweet. And so I, I do think I'd invite them. Now, I've got to say, for all we're not letting, you know, bias, cloud of judgment in terms of their items, thinking about other Cub Islanders, I don't think that they're the best. I think that they're definitely up there, but personally, I still prefer, you know, the look of Cody, the look of Poncho. But, see, and this is the problem, there's so many cute bear cubs. Like, I don't know who the red one is, but is it like Cherry? Cherry, yes, I have the her on my island. There's just so many, and Maple, so many oh, cute maple. bear cubs that I don't know. They just seem like another really cute bear cub. So for all, I don't think they're mind-blowing. I think they definitely haven't broken the kind of trend of bears being adorable. So they, they are definitely up there with Judy and all of them. So maybe A tier. I'd be yeah. tempted to go S tier if they were a bit more unique looking, but I think A tier is the place for that. Yeah, like you said, there's just so many amazing bears. Um, in terms of the concept, I'm not too sure what kind of show or kind of series they are from. Like I am with, for example, the Hello Kitty one. So I guess that can't influence what I'm thinking too much. But the cubs are cute and I do really like them. So we're happy with A tier, maybe the end of A tier if others kind of... Yeah, I guess for now we just put them to the front and if they need moving yeah. back or anything then we can adjust it accordingly. We can indeed and with that we are moving on to the second villager and that is going to be Rilla. So the name is, I don't know, I guess it's quite sweet, it's obviously coming from Gorilla given they're a Gorilla type islander but... Oh, honestly, I feel like this one, this one falls a little bit short for me. So I do really like Hello Kitty, or at least I did when I was a lot younger. And so to that end, I feel like I've got some concepts that I could have added. For example, the cat villagers are so cute. We could have had a white cat islander with the little red bow in their hair, some whiskers, almost like a replica of Hello Kitty themselves. I don't particularly like the gorilla aesthetic, and so perhaps that clouds my judgment. I Again, like I said, I quite like the Rilla name, abbreviation of gorilla, but I feel like they could have done that with any islander, and so to that end, I'm not, not too hyped for this one. Yeah, I'm in exactly the same boat of you. Now, I think in terms of gorillas, the vast majority of gorillas I find relatively horrific. I must say, I am a big fan of Boone. Perhaps that is a bit of a callback because I love Rafiki from The Lion King and Boone looks like Rafiki. I've got to say, I think that this might be the second best gorilla only losing out to Boone. However, being the second best gorilla really isn't something to kind of, to, you know, to, to scream about. Oh. Yeah, it's like being the second best child when there's only three. It's... You, you're not you're not really there. It's just, I, I don't know. It, it falls short. 
And I know that there's a lot of defenders of Rilla saying, you know, the the Hello Kitty creation isn't technically a cat, you know, it's a human in a cat suit or something like that. But I don't think there was any reason to not have the Hello Kitty representation be a cute cat. Because for all, there's a lot of them. You know, you've got Raymond who blew yeah. up in popularity. There's Anka. But I think a Hello Kitty cat would have been more fitting than Rilla, to be honest. I don't yeah. see their appeal too much. I'd agree with you there. So are we okay to say C tier, do you think? <sighs> see... Normally, I'd say no, because we always set a C tier up in terms of our old KK slider um, rankings. You know, we wouldn't have them at all. But we've set a C tier up as it wouldn't impact our lives if they weren't in the game, or if they weren't added in. So, it's in order, you know, for that end, I do think a C tier is where they belong. Because if it was, if C tier was to represent, we would never, ever have them. Yeah, I'm then never, ever I wouldn't put them in C tier. But... I don't think it would have impacted me if they were never added in. So yeah. I do think that is right. Indeed. So guys, with that, we are moving on to number three, which is Toby. Okay, so here we have Toby. And they're a cute little bunny, right? Um, Let's zoom in on them and just take a closer look. Like we said, guys, we want to give you the option to be able to comment down below on these islanders. So I think they're quite sweet. They have a little bit more of a hairstyle than some do with that cute little fringe parting there. Um, I don't feel like they're the best of the bunnies, admittedly. Um, but they're still sweet enough. I mean, JB, what do you think? I'm a bit lost with this one because I'm thinking of, you know, of the Gaston's friendlier relative. Um, but I don't know many other bunnies. There's Snake, there's... Gaston, there's... I don't know. They're not not standing out to me. I think they're very middle tier because they're adorable. They're cute. But I don't know if I'd even have them on our island or my own section of the <laughs> island because I don't dislike bunnies, but I don't really know any bunnies that I'm, like, really, really on board with. But I think... Say if you could show... If they could show up by chance... I wouldn't be sad at all. I'd no, be quite happy. I wouldn't be sad to see them in like the campsite or something. Yeah. If I was doing an Easter Island, which I kind of want to do, but I also think there's too much stigma around Bunny Day to even risk that, I feel like I'd use them then. So yeah, they are very zipper, aren't they? They are indeed. So I'm thinking, just because like without a specific theme, I don't think I'd want them. Maybe the top of B or lower A. I think B is fair because. Because for all they're not bad, they're very, I guess they're a specific taste. You're either going to yeah. really, really want them or you're not. And I don't think I really want them. No. So I guess that's, that's where that fits in. Indeed. So guys, the next one we are going to meet is Chelsea. So let's take a little look at them. Let's zoom in a little bit. Now, I believe these are the same type as Zell, for example. The, is it the deer? Yeah, so Zell, um, not Eric. Who's the one that isn't Eric? That's that sounds awful. Is it like Daddy? Someone? I don't know. Fauna. Fauna. Yes, oh, Fauna. I and I Fauna. like Fauna. I like Fauna a lot. Now I might have shocked some people here. I really, I think, I think these are my least favorite besides Rilla. I'm not feeling oh. them at all. I don't really like the hairstyle. Maybe with different hair they would be cute, or like oh, a different top, dear. but I'm not liking them at all. I'm I'm going to interrupt you there, because I actually really like Dear Islanders. Zell has always been, they've always had a little special place in my heart. I love them. And I think this one is no exception. They are so cute. I love the little ears, and then there's the headband ears as well, but just naturally. And even the shape of the face is adorable. I'm quite a girly girl, so seeing the, like, pink aesthetic I'm in love with. Like you said, maybe the hair could be a bit different. Maybe the headband's not needed. But, I mean, I'm definitely not seeing them as low as C tier. I can say that much. I mean, I'm, I mean, they're definitely, I like them more than Rilla, for sure. I don't know what it is with me. I just don't think the vibe particularly works. Like, they kind of look like... Something that you'd get on the set of the the Johnny Depp Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory movie. It just it, it's it's odd. It's it's wacky and it's out there, which I appreciate. But I think it's that type of thing again, where they've done something so not 
wacky because it's not like a mad design but they've done like a more unconventional color yeah. palette that to me just screams like weird you know like in the hunger games when mm-hmm. people in the capital will dress a bit odd they'll like dye their hair a weird color and then that's like the thing you know that people think is in trend maybe i'm just like the old man boomer that's like oh back in my day we wouldn't do this so maybe that's it maybe my taste is just off with this one but I think that's fair. Yeah. I was going to I definitely fight prefer you. them to Toby. I prefer them to... No, I prefer Toby to them. So I'm, I'm having a bit of trouble there, but not... Are you for real? I prefer Toby. I was going to fight you on this, that they needed to be A tier. And then you made that Charlie and the Chocolate Factory comment, and I can't unsee it. So I had to move them down to B. I mean, I think that's okay, a fair okay, compromise. Okay, no, we'll because, do this. We'll do this. But I prefer Toby. And, and this is going to happen because Toby's got that hair as well, but... I guess to me, Toby is an obvious anthropomorphic bunny, and it kind of works, you know, the green and yellow, it Mm. kind of fits in with a vibe that I'm used to, maybe I'm just not used to seeing green and white together, it's just to me, it's such a stark contrast that, I don't know, it's just a bit jarring for me personally. Okay guys, so two left, and the next one is Chai. So, here we have them, guys. Right, to me, this is Esther. I'm saying that right <laughs> off the bat. I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I never normally say that, but to me, this is Esther, 100%. Like, they remind me of Tia. They're yep. adorable. There's so much... I don't even remember many of the Elephant Islanders. Like, um, I think Agent... Not Agent S. There's one that's a bit like Agent S. That's another... I think Big Top. Yeah, Big Top. But... From all the elephants that I can remember, this is my favourite elephant islander. I love them. I think they're amazing. I mean, I know we said that we're not going to like include any of the items that they come with, but even the range for this is incredible. There's little like little mug seats and oh, it, just items that make you feel the Brewster vibe so much that it's so exciting. The islander themselves, like you said, you want to say S tier. I think their eyes are stunning. Like, just look at them. I feel like they have some of the best eyes of any of the islanders. I love how this, they've kind of got this little nervous side smile look. Can you see that? Aww, kind was, of like they're almost yeah. a bit shy, which Aww. is just so cute. I think I'd maybe get rid of the t-shirt and start gifting them some clothes. But I mean, yeah, I can't argue with that. That being said, the clothes the clothes can be changed. This islander does not need to be their S tier. Yeah, I think that is a really good choice. <laughs> and I just love them so much. So, wow. Okay, so we have one more to rank. Please, again, let us know what is your favourite in the comments. And do subscribe because we are really excited for this. And if you want to see some more categories of um, ones that we can do for a tier list, please let us know. Indeed. So- Esther. Another Esther. Oh, okay, this another is going to get controversial. No, another Esther. This is another Esther. Okay, JB. Come on. This is the second, maybe even first best sheep islander. This is the best sheep, I will give you that. Oh, there with but Pietro. In my, opin- in my opinion, all the sheep are literally like Z tier. They are no, as no, far no, low as no, you can go. No. For me, sheep and gorillas don't even deserve a place on the island. Gorillas, I, really don't gorillas, like I can see that because even the best of the gorillas isn't that great. But Pietro is enough to redeem somewhat the the sheep line. Now, there's a lot of stinkers in my opinion of sheep. There's like what is Wendy, there's, Wendy, there's, there's Barbara. Barbara um, I don't know who who else there is, but there's there's Soil a lot there's a lot of bad bad mm. sheep. Timbro, but. But, 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 Pietro, and now, um, I don't know if it's a toil, a toi, the people are saying a lot of different <laughs> things, but this sheep islander is S tier to me. If not S tier, then a top of A tier, because to me, this is one of the inclusions that I feel was necessary. Like, the reason why I was a bit, a bit, you know, come see, come sa with the bear islander is because we don't need them. No one needed a bear to redeem, you know, the bear cubs. Mm. Everyone loved the bear cubs, you know, but we needed an, a gorilla. Now, this isn't the gorilla we needed, but we needed a gorilla to promote the gorilla line. And I feel like we also needed a sheep to promote the sheep line. And this is it. Now there's two pretty good sheep, maybe even three, because I know some people really like Muffy. So... Honestly, this has legitimized sheep quite I'm, a lot. I'm going to do this to you, okay? 
Are you telling me you want to put both of these in the same tier? Yeah. What? Okay, maybe. What do you mean? I, I didn't think it was going to go that well. <laughs> what, did you think you were going to like scan it in and it was going to be like yeah. the smoking gun? Like, this is the evidence. This is what we're dealing okay. with. Come on. This is up there with Pietro. They are amazing. I love them so much. Who's the highest in S tier then? Oh, don't say that. Okay. Hmm. Oh, because I feel that elephants needed a boost as well, but look at the sheep. Okay, do you know what, The right? colour, the purple, the dots. You are selling me on this a little bit. I do like the dots. The I love the purple. Pin. It's like celestial. I just don't like the ears, but... The ears are fine. The ears are fine. You didn't like the elephant's t-shirt. Maybe we can put a hat on them. They're like a jester hat and it'll be like Pietro's, like, cousin. Gift on the jester hat. Okay, JB, you need to be nice to me for the rest of the <laughs> day now. Let's put them on second, eh? This second. is happening. Oh, yeah! I'm happy. I'm happy. That just happened. That I've accepted your immediate surrender. Why are you displaying them? Why not? We've got the nah. S tiers here, guys. Hey, champions! Let's move JB out of the way. He's upset me now. JB is Esther. Look at them. Okay. I love them so much. So guys, this is the tier list and the S tiers are stood there. Let us know down below who you like the best, who you're wanting to invite to your island, who you might have already invited to your island, and of course, if you want to see the item tier list as well, comment that below and we will make sure to bring those to you. So guys, we hope you've enjoyed this video and for more Animal Crossing content and indeed all things Nintendo including Mario and so, so much more, please like, comment and subscribe. JB and Melly.